Rudraprayag is about 70 kilometers from Devprayag and 165 kilometers from Haridwar. It is situated on Himalayan mountains about 650 meters above the sea level. It was the month of August. The temperature of outside was warm, but the temperature of water was very cool. There are ancient temples of Rudranath and Jagadamba in Rudraprayag. As per the mythology, says Narada meditated here for a long time. Rudraprayag is famous for the Sangam or confluence of river Mandakini and river Alkananda. This is a bridge on the river. Standing on the bridge, you can get beautiful views of the river, the Snanaghat, the huge Shiva statue and all the surrounding views. Rudraprayag is one of the five prayags on Himalayas. As per Hindu religion, bathing in Prayag is considered to be very sacred. I got into the river for taking a holy bath. The waves were very strong and pushing me from all sides. It was very pleasant to take bath in the cool river in the warm sunlight. After I finished bathing, mom went into water. The place was very safe for bathing because of the platforms and steps. Mom was quite comfortable to bath alone without needing any support. Ste <laughs> There was a statue of Lord Shiva on the bathing hut. The statue was about 15 feet high. It was portraying the views of Himalayan mountains around Lord Shiva. After spending about half an hour near the statue, we left this side of the bathing hut and went to the other side. As you can see, on this side, there is a huge platform made of red cement. It was like a big roof on the water with cement bench for sitting. This was a marvelous place to enjoy the views of the wild river. From this side, we could see the Sangam of the two rivers properly. This narrow stream of the clean water at the left side was river Alkananda, which was flowing from Badrinath. At 
and the river flowing on our right side was river mandakini which was flowing from kedarnath and this was the sangam or confluence of both these rivers after their confluence they become one as alkananda and flow towards the prag om nama this is the kedar badri samiti rest house where we stayed in rudraprayag we enjoyed this beautiful place for a day next morning on 9th august we left rudraprayag and continued our journey towards gaurikund which was about 75 kilometers ghat route from rudraprayag